Number 21. A diffraction grating has 2,000 lines per centimeter. At what angle will the first order maximum be for 520 nanometer wavelength green light? So the first thing, anytime they give you the number of lines per distance, we can always then find, you know, or per unit length, we can always find then the distance between the slits or AKA the lines. So we just simply do that by actually inverting, you know, 2000 lines per centimeter. We can just say then the centimeters per line will then give me the distance between those lines. All right. So I can simply then take one divided by 2000 and that will come out to be five times 10 to the minus fourth. But you gotta be careful, this is now centimeters. We need that in meters, all right? So you gotta further divide that by 100 essentially. All right, so just be careful, okay? So this is really times 10 to the minus two at the top if you wanted to think about it that way. Now, uh, this goes back to you know maximum double slit interference patterns we're using the formula over here so it's going to be that the distance between the slits multiplied by the sine of the angle is now equal to the order multiplied then by the wavelength if i want to find the angle i have to divide out the distance between the slits so that's why i did the first part and now if i want to find the angle i got to do the inverse sine of both sides so i can get rid of the sine on the left now what we need to do is basically just plug it all in so first order max, so it's one, the wavelength there was 520 nanometers, so you gotta multiply that by 10 to the minus ninth to get that into meters. Then divide that by now five times 10 to the minus sixth. And let's see, so inverse sine, 520 times 10 to the minus ninth divided by five times 10 to the minus sixth. And we're gonna get a value here of about 5.97 or so. And that's in terms of degrees. Guys, thanks so much for tuning in, appreciate it. I'll see you in the next problem. All right, thank you very much and have a great day.